Adapting to climate change is high priority for the Pakistan government, but the task is enormous. According to the United Nations, Pakistan is among the six countries that face the biggest impact from climate change, with risks of floods, melting glaciers and droughts. UN says Pakistan's forest cover is now among the lowest in the world, about 5% of the land compared with a global average of 31%. But all that is changing. Pakistan's billion tree plantation drive across 350,000 hectares was the first bond challenge pledge to hit and surpass its commitment. The basic uh, objective of this project was to improve the socio-economic condition and environmental condition. The project has now been upscaled to 10 billion tree tsunami, a five-year country-wide tree planting drive to restore depleted forests and mitigate climate change. The government of Pakistan is in the first phase of planting 3.25 billion trees at an estimated cost of around $650 million. Nassar Khan has been a part of the reforestation project since it began in 2014. Pakistan Since the creation of Pakistan, we have not seen a bigger project than this. It has many benefits. It produces oxygen and eliminates carbon dioxide from the air. In Khyber Pakhtunkhwa province, the Billion Tree program has already raised the region's forest cover to 27%. This is an investment for the generations to come. We can't see the benefits of this project now, but with time, when the trees grow into a forest, the project will benefit the people. Experts say the project is restoring ecosystems and also absorbing planet-warming carbon emissions. Pakistan is also trying to aim for uh, carbon neutrality. I know China has announced two, uh, 2060 as the year for carbon neutrality. A lot of other countries are doing it. So we did an internal exercise. And at the moment, our, our carbon emissions are about 500 million tons uh, in Pakistan. We are not a big emitter. A total plantation target of 430 million has already been achieved and a total of 1 billion plantation target is set for June this year. Pakistan is planting trees that are native and need relatively little water. The program is expected to prevent land degradation and improve aquifer. Going down from the alpine forests of KP to the scrub forests of Punjab, uh, dry afforestation in Balochistan, and then down to the mangroves and the riverine forests of Sindh. All of the forests are covered and we are increasing uh, those forests uh, all, all over Pakistan. The government has set up hundreds of plant distribution centers across the country to provide saplings to people free of cost. Daniel Khan, CGTN, Peshawar.